again welcome back to my channel i know i know i have not made a video in so long but i'm happy to kind of get back into the groove uh with the blogging breakdown i revamped the whole um blogging headquarters on bella style living so definitely go check it out i have all of the posts related to blogging tips tricks truths everything you can find it there so i'll go ahead and link it down below for you to go check that out in the meantime i thought that i would start uh, sharing some like things that I know I used to Google <laughs> or search on YouTube whenever I first started. And one of the things being an influencer, content creator, blogger was making collages, especially for the fashion niche on LTK. Uh, you know, there's a lot of people who make fashion collages and I always wondered how do they do that? So um, I've run through PicMonkey, I've done other um, applications, but the one that I came back to the most was definitely Canva. I preach this from the, the rooftops, like Canva is it. Like if you're a blogger, influencer, content creator, get yourself Canva for creating graphics, product collages, fashion collages, like just about anything you can, even the YouTube thumbnails I make on Canva. So I have a blog post um, that I've linked down below explaining this whole process. But if you wanted to see it on real time, then just keep on watching. Okay, so I have um, Canva pulled up. So in order to do what I am trying to do whenever you're trying to make like product collages and things like that, do have to have the Canva Pro version, which is a paid subscription to Canva. Now there is a free version, which you can do a ton of other stuff. The one thing that you cannot do is the background remover. And I will show you in a little bit why that is important. But if you have the capability or the means, I definitely would suggest getting the Canva Pro version. Canva Pro version will also allow you to upload fonts that will be a little bit more brand specific. So if you're somebody who's wanting to be very consistent across social channels on your blog, things like that, by using the same colors and font, you can do that with the pro version. So I definitely suggest if you're taking this very seriously, like I am, uh, get yourself the pro version. I think it's about $14.99. You can pay it monthly or you can get a discount if you pay it, uh, the annual fee in full. I am on the monthly plan um, and it works just fine. First thing you're gonna do is whenever you have your Canva, you're gonna go to create design. Once you are on there, you can pick from any of the dimensions that you see on here. So if you're gonna create an Instagram story, you would click Instagram story, Pinterest pin, things like that. For me, I use a lot of these product collages and fashion collages for my LTK. So the LTK dimensions, um, I also have those linked on the blog post, which is down below. Um, and those dimensions are 1080 by 1350 pixels. So I just go ahead and do uh, create my own dimensions and then you can create that design. So that is gonna pull up a blank workspace for you. I like to design the backdrop first. Um, it just makes it so much easier for me. If you go to these designs, they will have a ton of uh, templates that you can use. You can even go to search the template uh, to let's see, let's see what happens if we put product collage. I never do this, but I just wanted to see. Um, so in this case, you can like, you know, pick any of these. Maybe you want to pick that you click on it and it transfers it over to your workspace. And then you can plug, uh, your images as you go. In my case, I like to keep it. Um, I like to create my own stuff. So I will do is I will just make my own so I have my colors I have uploaded my brand colors here which again you can do in your pro version so I just click whatever color I want and it will transfer to my workspace and again you can get as creative as you want here it's really up to you but for the sake of this video we're just going to keep it very very simple um, I also suggest putting a title uh, describing whatever the product collage is especially on LTK a lot of people will start skimming the feeds and so you want to tell them what it is so in this case today we're going to be sharing h&m new arrivals i really hate this font which is just a default font so let's go ahead and change it over to futura futura uh which is very popular um obviously you want to make sure you stay within the parameters so it doesn't look bad um and then again kind of play around move it around 
Um, and there we go. So H&M New Arrivals is what we're doing. I have already pulled some looks here up top. So I'm going to show you how to transfer the pictures from the uh, brand websites onto canvas. Grab the images off of here. Um, it looks like H&M must have changed their website because it didn't used to look like this. But anyways, I just need to grab the picture, which you can do by doing a screenshot from your screen. On my Mac, it's Command, Shift, and 4. That will make this little cursor, this little crosshair right here. And what I do is I just pull the image that I want to copy, which is that, and then let go, and it has my screenshot here. I'm also going to do this one over here. So Command, Shift, 4, so I can grab this one. I am also going to grab this skirt, which I think is so cute. So let's grab this. And then there was a cream sweater. Oh, that's a cute hat, um, which I'm gonna grab over here. So, and there we go. So once I have my images, they usually get saved to my desktop or wherever you send your screenshots to. Um, the next thing that you need to do is upload them to Canva. So you will go to upload files and then they're usually on my desktop so they are right here i will just grab these um, if you want to upload eat all four at the same time just press down command on your uh, mac and then it will highlight all four of them and then you can upload and then it will upload all of the products and so right here it's uploading once it's fully upload then you can start transferring them over to your workspace so let's go ahead and put them here you can make them smaller or larger, however you like. You'll just um, hold down the right button on your mouse here at the corners and then you can make them bigger or smaller, whatever you wanna do. Um, I'm gonna transfer this one over here. And then let's go ahead and do this one over here. Make it a little bit smaller. Try to make it similar size, I guess. And there you go. Um, so there I have all four of my products. And now here is where that pro version comes into place. I feel like it looks better whenever you take off the background. Also, if you start grabbing images from different websites, they all have different backgrounds. Um, and so that can look a little off. So in this case, I will remove the background by highlighting the picture. I go to edit photo and then clear, uh, click here on your tools, BG remover, that's the background remover. You click on it and it will start removing the background. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that for all four of my products. And there you go. So now I have my product collage all done. I will go ahead and just kind of edit it around to my liking. Um, also for any of you who do like to post on LTK, I highly recommend putting a brand identifier. So in this case, I will probably put like my website, bellastyleliving.com. And then let's make that a little bit smaller and just put it anywhere. You can put your logo, you can put your Instagram handle, um, wherever you want people to like associate your collages with. Um, so it can make it even smaller. I can even move this up a little bit. So it's, you know, just whatever you like. There we go. And that is it. That is how you make a product collage on Canva, the easy peasy way. You could definitely make it a little bit more advanced as you go. But if you're just looking for the basics, then this is the way that all the influencers are doing it. Well, not all of them, but you know, most of them. Next thing that you will do to finalize this and to be able to upload it to the LTK Creator app or to your blog or anything like that, you can go ahead and share it and then download and then uh, just download that. You can even title it if you want. I highly suggest putting some sort of keyword here before you download if you're gonna be uploading this to your blog because again, with SEO, it gives it a chance to be discoverable on Google, so definitely wanna do that. So I'm gonna go ahead and just download that 
and that is it. From there, I can go ahead and airdrop it to my phone. And then I go into the LTK Creator app, upload it to, you know, be able to post on my LTK storefront. So if you wanna check out some of the other templates, uh, definitely go ahead and check out my LTK storefront. I'll link that information down below for you to check out um, to get a little bit inspired. I also have an LTK template that are pre-made that you can purchase off of Etsy. I will leave the link down below for you. I need to upload a little bit more um but if you just want to get something started uh you can definitely check that one out as well i hope this was useful for you if you have any questions don't forget to leave them in the comments i'll be more than happy to answer those for you go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you found this tutorial useful and uh don't forget to subscribe all right we'll talk later bye